Hello, and a very warm welcome to Keele University. I'm Trevor McMillan, and I have the great privilege of being the Vice-Chancellor here. Thank you for taking the time to visit our site today. We do recognise how big a decision it is for you to choose your university, and this virtual open day has been designed to anticipate the questions that you might have about Keele, and to give you the chance to investigate what we have to offer in a bit more detail. I want to just spend a few minutes giving you some of the background about the university before you get into that detail. Keele is built around academic excellence and a fantastic student experience sits alongside world-class research in a combination that you won't see in all universities. We were formed in 1949 as a university with a very strong focus on innovative education and a strong student experience. And that was to sit in a university with a very clear social conscience that addresses research that is important to society. We are also a university that has a strong sense of community, as well as having an important role in the communities outside the university that we partner with, both locally and indeed around the world. You can imagine that when we were formed, it was important that the university rose to the challenge of needing to support students in very uncertain times, providing opportunities for students from all backgrounds and preparing them for a rapidly changing employment situation where the number and nature of the jobs available wasn't clear. Our predecessors did take on that challenge and it is a legacy that we hold on to very strongly and it's probably more relevant now than it has been at any point since that post-war period. We strive for a very student-centred approach to our education and that has been reflected in strong performance in assessments of our teaching, including gold in the Teaching Excellence Framework, an unparalleled performance in the National Student Survey over nearly a decade and graduate employment figures that show that the vast majority of our students get jobs that do require a degree level education. Sadly, it's not possible for us to hold this open day on our campus at the moment. But when you do get here, you will find that at over 600 acres, we have the biggest university campus in the UK, with lots of green space, which I'm sure we've all learned to value even more in the last few months, giving us plenty of space to keep safe. Within the campus, we have done a lot in recent years to enhance our facilities. Recent examples include over 400 new bedrooms, a new home for the Keele Business School, an extension to our medical school, a new vet school is currently under construction, and we've invested heavily in new teaching laboratories for the sciences, including the David Attenborough Laboratories, and it was a great pleasure to see Sir David on campus last year to open those facilities. While I was here, we talked a lot with Sir David about Kiel's approach to the environment and sustainability, in which we have, for example, turned our campus into a living laboratory to evaluate new ways to both generate and to use energy. We've recently ranked in the top 25 in the world in a global world rankings table looking at the green agenda. Creating a sustainable future is one of the key global challenges that we are addressing here. That is alongside, for example, social inclusion and global health. You can see the relevance of all of this to the current specific challenge we are all facing at the moment. And Kiel has responded in a variety of ways to address this. From looking at the biology of COVID-19 to the social implications of the pandemic, from the work our staff and students have done in the NHS to the production of hand sanitizer in our laboratories, we truly have had a big impact in the last few months. In addition, one of our companies based on our campus is likely to be manufacturing a COVID-19 vaccine right here at Kiel. The pandemic has also brought out innovation that I mentioned earlier in order to continue to deliver our courses safely, but with social distancing in place. That will be using a blend of digital and in-person learning in line with our published five-stage plan. The last few months have emphasised even more than usual to me how much effort we put into supporting our students when things get a bit tough. And I have to say that it is one of the things that I am proudest of about Kiel. When students do have difficulties, whether with their health, with finances, relationships or other things, we have many ways in which we can help. We have excellent support teams in the university and the student union, as well as, for example, a medical practice and a pharmacy on campus. Ultimately, our ambition for you is that you stand out from the crowd and go on to be successful and make a real contribution to society. A degree at Kiel won't just give you a certificate but countless other skills needed to succeed and to stand out in your chosen field. Our degrees are designed to make sure that you have breadth as well as depth in your knowledge. And we help our students prepare for employment in all sorts of ways, 
including by providing volunteering opportunities or placements and internships, some of which are within our integrated science and innovation park here on the Kiel campus. It might seem like a long way off, but your graduation will come upon you all too quickly, and we will make sure that you are as prepared as you can be for whatever comes next for you. And the 100,000 alumni we have around the world will provide a network that you will always be part of as an integral part of the Kiel community. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this. We hope that you will get to visit our beautiful campus in person soon. But in the meantime, you can hear what our students say about studying at Kiel, chat to our academics, and find out everything you need to know at our virtual open day today. Thank you.